pathological liars. They live in an alternate universe where they make up these stories and they sound great and you want to believe it, but you have to keep your circle tight because believe it or not, there's a thing called psychosis by association. You can actually take on people's perceptions and take it into yourself and then you start believing which is what we modern people call gaslighting, you start believing, but it's just not true. And how long are you going to play along with their little lies? But this one takes the cake. He played different characters and it was so much fun for a time. He was old man Amy, he was Uncle Chop Chop, he was even Giovanni, the European bloke. He was everything. But where does it stop being funny and comedic and where does it become <laughs> a personality disorder? I personally have had movie star crushes. I think, I don't know, who would actually own up to that? I'm owning up to it because I am, you know, doing this little social experiment. But I've actually, I, I remember a few years ago, I got into Jake Gyllenhaal, okay? So I got into Jake. Um, funnily enough, in my Facebook DMs, I got a message. You won't believe this, from Jake Gyllenhaal. It wasn't him, don't worry could lead to delusions of grandiose, where I was thinking, oh my God, a movie star's got a crush on me. That is a quirk that might lead to various other delusions, which could cause issues in relationships further down the track. What about the change of heart? Oh God, that hurts. You know, for two weeks they were into you, they were texting you every day, every hour of the day. And now, all of a sudden, you could hear a pinprick, radio silence, there's nothing there. Where have they gone? Maybe they've caught a ticket to ride on that ghosting train that everyone hears about. Easy come, easy go, don't forget that. Or the credible liars who tell you what you wanna hear. They sound perfect on paper, they sound great. They're telling you everything you wanna hear because they they know what you, they're intuitive. You know, know what would turn you on and they want you to like them. But how true is it? You know, do they really feel that way?